What's up everybody, my name is Dwight and today on GeForce Garage we're going to be building a beefy PC that can take on a creative tool like Adobe Premiere Pro without breaking a sweat. When editing video, speed is the key to success and creativity. A fast system will allow you to focus your time on creating instead of wasting your time watching progress bars. One of the great things about Premiere Pro is that it's optimized for GPU acceleration. The core video editing engine is built for GPUs and most of its new features are built to take advantage of the speed boost. For the true professional production house, a purpose-built Quadro workstation is best for its 24-7 reliability and long lifetime warranty. But for those with a less stringent production requirement, you can still get a huge boost by adding even a mid-range GPU to your own rig. For the pro video freelancer who really cares about speed, a build-your-own PC with a graphics card like the NVIDIA Titan XP is a great way to go. But hey, don't just take our word for it. We decided to put these theories to the ultimate test and created a purpose-built PC for the needs of Emmy-nominated writer and editor Adam Epstein of Saturday Night Live. Pros and Adam's line of work need the best, so we brought in one of the best, Lee Harrington from PC Junkie Mods. And he's gonna help us build a rig that's up to Adam's high standards. Okay, so what we have here is a super micro dual socket motherboard that supports two Xeons, not one, but two 2630 V3s, which are eight core, and they also have hyperthreading. So you're talking what? 16. 16, but 32 yeah. actual threads. Right, yeah. We went with Xeons because of the fact that they're designed more for workstation loads, and since he's gonna be doing a lot of video editing and stuff like that, this is perfect. Also, we have here 32 gigs of Kingston ECC 2133 memory. And we have a Thunderbolt card here. That was a special requirement from Adam. And then of course, you could use the Quattros, but the Titan will do just fine because of its high CUDA core count. Up next, we have some storage here. We're gonna use the two SSDs and a RAID 0 for the OS. And then we have an NVMe one terabyte OCZ RD400, just in case he needs a little bit more storage on the system. Yeah, and these uh, NVMe's have a pretty high input and output, which is really good for video editing. And we're gonna throw all this in the sleek Inwin 909, which is big enough for the extended ATX motherboard. I noticed that you're missing a couple of heat sinks. Yeah, it's funny you bring that up. Adam actually had a special request because he has a lot of client meetings in his office to have something a little bit quieter. So we're actually going to do a custom hardline water cooling loop for this system. Cool. Hey there, my name is Adam Epstein. I'm the editor for the Saturday Night Live film unit. We are currently in the offices where we work on our week's pieces. I hear the guys from NVIDIA are in town. They're down at PS260, the commercial house that I work at. And I hear they built something kind of cool. So we're gonna go check that out. What? This is amazing. Can we, uh, can we turn it on actually like get it running? It's actually on already. Okay. okay, it's like it's way too quiet, but I'll believe you since you're the one who made it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Ooh, water cooled. Yeah. We got a full custom water cooling, uh, EK water cooling, premature fittings, uh, even custom cables in here. Looks incredible. All right, Adam, we're gonna get out of your hair and let you enjoy your new machine. Guys, I don't even know how to thank you. It's uh, it's amazing. Seriously, you guys do incredible work. Yeah. Cheers to you both. Yeah. All right, now leave, please. Get out of here. <laughs> And there you have it. If you want to see how well Adam's beast of a rig handles 6K and even 8K footage, check out this video right here. Thanks Adam, thanks Lee, and thanks all of you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and we'll see you for the next one.